Let's uh, pull up the screen. Let's see what you got going on. Yeah. Let me share with you the progress of Facebook first. We'll yes, go let's here. go ahead. And last week we had a really bad progress and we saw that we were getting uh, less. We, we saw everything red on a start. So we were looking that things were not going well. And I have uh, spent uh, a good amount of work on Facebook. And I see that things are growing. You can see here post is increased 74 percent liked increased to 22 uh, post engagement increased as well and mm -hmm. as per plan we have posted three times uh, uh, a day and mm -hmm. let me just interrupt you real quick yeah. um the we're going to start branding uh, a new image so i will send to you um the new image that we're going to have okay okay and uh, and we we had some issue last week while i was reviewing the uh, blog um, articles um, uh, sent by jacqueline and i found out the images was with a lower resolution and i have replaced one and i told her to uh, use only high high resolution images and i have got an email from her that uh, she's started using um, high resolution email images and we need to make sure that we always have high resolution images because uh, image speaks louder than uh, the written text. Image attract the audiences fast. So we need to uh, make sure that we always have prominent, catchy, uh, engagement friendly and high resolution images. But did you take a look at those images? They're huge. Yeah, I, I saw, I, 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 saw <laughs> I took a look to the blogs. Uh, I think that this is the, the images is looking uh, big because of the settings of, of the uh, site. Otherwise, I don't think that the images are, are that big. <laughs> and then why are we using Mailgun uh, on our... Why is Mailgun being posted on the Facebook there? Sorry? I see Mailgun is being uh, marketed there. Email automation. Why are we putting that, that image? Uh, oh, Mailgun. Yeah, I don't think that that'd be a good thing to have. <laughs> that would be that'd be sort of a a soft competitor. Yeah. Oh, I thought that it might be um, good information about about the WordPress plugin uh, that might be relevant to our uh, uh, brand. So I wanted. I don't know that they are our competitors. I, I will yeah, uh, take, take it's down. It's a soft the competitor. It's not a direct okay. competitor. It's a soft competitor. I mean, look, let's not waste any time. Let's just leave it. It's not okay. going to be painful. There's no one really looking at it. We reached eight people. <laughs> it's not the end uh, of the world. But uh, at least so that you're aware. Uh, and you will learn with time that, you know, hey, this is uh, a competitor. We definitely want to be branding their, their services. Uh, but, yeah, that that's, would be a soft competitor. Not direct, but soft competitor. Uh, uh, okay. But, yeah, I'd leave it. It's not, it doesn't, it's not going to do anything, right? Okay. And I, I, but, but I told Jacqueline to use the images that is around... Uh, 1k into 1k because usually uh, uh, for uh, social sites we use the um, um, images that are 1k into 1k that is the standard size uh, if he uses uh, images like uh, 3k into 2k then the images uh, might be bigger but okay. i have i haven't seen uh, images in any blocks like we have on our blocks that are gigantic really uh, humongous you know yeah, so she needs to tone them down somehow, correct? She has to yeah. like resize them or, or something. Yeah. Don't you agree? Yeah. yeah, I agree. Can you show her how to do that? Because it just doesn't look appealing. Yeah, I, I will get in touch with uh, her. She, she um, informed me that she knows everything and she's um, informing me while uh, she has been doing anything. And she, uh, I, will, I will let her know to show how, how to resize images on WordPress. All right, great. Thank you. Okay, I have done some work on the uh, group. You can see that I have posted uh, on content on our uh, Facebook group, and you can see that the member increased to seventeen. Are those real members? Yeah, they these are real members, and some of them are uh, doing marketing as well. Uh, you can see that someone. Uh, um, I, to be honest, I have invited all of my friends and 
some of um, them might be a good uh, potential client for us. Okay, great. And you can see that post is seen by uh, 12 people among those 17 people and I will be working more uh, as we know that um, getting more members to the group is not easier like um, uh, uh, it was previously. Anyway, yes. I, will, uh, I will put effort on Facebook group along with, with Facebook page. We have got really good uh, progress on Twitter. We have got more than 2K. Last week we, we had almost uh, 900 followers on, on uh, Twitter. We have uh, reaching almost 11 100 followers on on Twitter and you can see the progress here you can see everything is green impression increased mm -hmm. by 18 K profile visits uh, that is the biggest we have so far 700 almost 800 and we have got 19 mentions and you can see that people are saying good thing about us that thanks for following state B tech you have a lot of interesting thoughts and sharing good tweets like this okay great and on instagram we have 650 followers like last week we have 718 mm -hmm. followers this week and i am posting uh, consistently on instagram but we are not getting enough engagement because uh, uh, instagram changed recently and uh, from the web they are not allowing to follow more than 15 people they are changing things um, uh, really quick and making things 15 um, or you mean 1500 15 you can't follow more than 15 people at a time on instagram with the recent change earlier uh, uh, firstly um, uh, a couple of years back we were able to follow 160 people uh, at a time in a in, in an hour and then they have decreased that to 39 and now oh i see i see per hour you're talking about 15 yeah. per hour okay yeah didn't make any sense 15 people that's yeah. it okay yeah no got it we will be able to follow uh, uh, maximum of 700, 75k people on, on Instagram. Okay, and, great. Uh, and you can see that we, we are on the right track on, on LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. um, the number of profile view, uh, views increased from 150 to 171. And we are almost uh, to um, 500 uh, connections. And then we will be... Um, moving to from beginner level to intermediate level on LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. And, and what's that going to help us being intermediate? So the more connections we have, we move up to an intermediate. And how does that help yeah. us? And um, to be honest, when you will move to an intermediate level, people will put more attention to you. They will find out as uh, you as as established LinkedIn user. And when you will go to here, all star or expert level, they, then you will get more interactions, more engagement, and um, uh, each of your messages, messages on, on LinkedIn will be considered uh, with importance. Mm, interesting. And how to get to the expert, what do we have to do? Yeah. To be honest, if we get more, more connections, usually people, um, when people have uh, 5, 5, 500 connections, they move to intermediate level, and when they have um, 1500 to 3k uh, connections um, they move to the all star level and, that's if they uh, don't change the rules <laughs> yeah and, and uh, you know uh, if we change things and put more information as, as we are switching to um, uh, uh, I, I have got the information from you yesterday and I will update the profile and if uh, we update uh, things like I was I was asking for the education back um, educational background because the more information you put on a profile the more uh, it will uh, 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 get engaged with with the people on on uh, LinkedIn. Awesome, awesome. Well, I have no questions about LinkedIn. We just got to keep moving forward to the expert levels. So when we're posting our articles, they're just mind blowing. Everyone's gonna love it. So let's go on. Uh, is there something else you want to show me here or you want to jump to the next thing? Uh, to be honest, we, we are done with the things that we are. Okay. So then we have, um, what about YouTube? Have you posted, did you post our URL on the YouTube thing? Can you pull that up? To be honest, you know, uh, no, I have given that some times to uh, grow and I have done some sharings 
last couple of days to increase the views of those that will help us on SEO. And I have uh, I was listening to a blog that um, um, more than a couple of uh, videos on on a uh, YouTube channel per week won't help that much. And to be honest, it, I won't have to do a lot of work to upload videos. Um, so uh, we have the videos. Uh, uh, so I was thinking that I will upload another couple of videos this week on on our YouTube channel. Well, there's a couple of things we left off. First of all, we want to have it on steady schedule. So every week you post at the exact same time, same day. So if you have it consistent on a Monday or on a Thursday, whatever it might be, um, you'd want to go ahead and post that for that um, that time frame. And we also talked about last week that you have to put in our URL, our link. I mean, it's just not there. So um, that needs to be done too. So how soon would you be able to do that? And what day do you want to have um, our calls being posted uh, weekly? Okay. Okay, I, I'm going to um, uh, include the link uh, of our website in the description. Uh, and uh, once we are done with the call, or weekly call, I will um, upload the call immediately on YouTube. Well, we're already kind of in advance. So I think we're like three weeks behind right is that how we yeah. planned it yeah. so i guess after our call now you'd post video number three or something like that correct yeah yeah even though we're on video number seven so we have a little bit of buffer room if we miss a week or something like that agree so it's just consistent consistent consistency agree yeah yeah i agree all right john and i for our little podcast on on email marketing email delivery and things of that sort mm -hmm. We've decided on Thursday he'd be posting it. So if you can do any day other than Thursday, that would be ideal. Okay. I will. Excellent. So then you've answered all my questions. I have no questions. So then we'll, uh, I'll look forward to the next video. And then we'll follow up on Monday again. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Amin. Great okay, job. Bye-bye. Well, take care. Bye-bye.